Lenten greetings to you as we begin this holy season of Lent. As we set out on this annual campaign of Christian service from the Collect for Ash Wednesday, let us begin with some words of wisdom. These are not my own words, but those are the scriptures. The church acclaims, quote, you are merciful to all, O Lord, and despise nothing that you have made. You overlook people's sins to bring them to repentance, and you spare them, for you are the Lord our God. Consider that the many attributes of God, the church calls him merciful on this day. All that we will recall in the life of our Lord in the weeks ahead are motivated by the mercy of his Father. God is indeed holy, just, true, eternal, and more. But this holy season starts by recalling God's mercy. A second insight from our wise Antiphon is related to the first. God despises nothing he has made. Rather far from despising us, God loves us beyond all words. In a small quirk of the calendar, this Ash Wednesday falls on Valentine's Day, a day that has become known to celebrate the romantic love between people. But the austerities and penances of Ash Wednesday need not eclipse the love otherwise expressed on St. Valentine's Day. For the love of God, like his mercy, should fill our hearts as we work our way toward Easter. Finally, let us bear in our mind that God overlooks our sins and spares us. This God, who is mercy and love, wants only joy and fullness of life for us. Recall Jesus' words, God did not send his son into the world to condemn the world, but rather that the world might be saved through him. Brothers and sisters, I pray that each of us may have a holy Lent. As a helpful first step, let us be convinced of God's mercy, love, and desire for our life to the full. God be with you.